It's time to talk about legit free orchestral libraries that actually sound very good. Today I want to talk about layers by orchestral tools. I used it to write this sketch here. So that was the Castle Tools layers, and this is a sketch I wrote with it in a couple of minutes. I also wrote another sketch with layers. You can download layers for free in the description of this video. What I love about this library is the sound. This is almost out of the box sound. I only have OTT on the master as well as isotoposon. But if I disable isotoposon, it's still the same sound, just a little bit less loud. OTT is a free plugin you can download that clears the sound. I talked about it in the past. You're gonna find the description of this video, it's free. What you notice when you use layers or when you saw this is that a single note is a whole chord progression. The reason for it is that layers is a library that is made exactly that way. For each one of these patches, you have different articulations that actually play chords. You have a major chord articulation, minor chord, and these are sustains. Then you have sus4 sustain. Sus4 is a chord that is sort of like in between major and minor, so you can use it to make some very interesting movements, like I did here. So this is Sus4, and this is major. So G Sus4 to G major is very interesting, like... So you can do that kind of stuff very easily, even if you don't know music theory, you just download this library, you just play around with it, see what feels good to you, and eventually you will learn, like, by using this sort of, like, building block, you're like, oh, SAS4 chords are actually very cool, let me go on Google and look what they look like, how they sound like, actually, and then you can start to internalize them in your music. You also have staccato articulations with the same chords, so staccato major, staccato minor, staccato SAS4, and then you also have unison articulations, but only for the low end, so you can play Stuff like this, but if you go too high, it's not gonna play anymore. I use the low end unison to enforce the bass line in certain parts. So here. With everything on. So that's just to enforce the harmonies. Now, it also sounds very good for emotional music as I showed you in the second example, but another thing I wanted to show you is that I'm using a piano library that is another free library from Spitfire called Labs Piano. When I play it on its own, it sounds like this. These are in tracks that I spent so much time on. Actually, I only wrote them in a few minutes. And if you want to learn how to orchestrate sketches super quick in a way that is very effective, I recommend you check out the Cinematic Sketching course by Arn Anderson at Evnant. Link in the description of this video. But it's good to start with this sort of building blocks. You can use these libraries to just sketch something that sounds good because it's sounds amazing out of the box. You can also use them with patience to write tracks that are full and could totally be sold on Audio Jungle. So layers and labs piano are great tools that I didn't have when I started out. You guys have the luck of having these new, beautiful sounding free libraries available to anyone. Links down below in this video. So you can start now. If you want to make music, you don't have any funding, you can still write music with this, sell it online, earn money, buy more libraries, earn more money, and get better and better by courses, etc. All of this is accessible for you right now. They are making it as easy as possible for us to start and make a career out of this stuff. So what's your excuse?